from ancient antagonistic arachnids to the feathered tails of dinosaurs. Here are 13 of the most ancient animals preserved in amber. 13. Ant v. Wasp. Forever. Some amber unearthed in Myanmar in 2012 revealed an epic struggle frozen in time for upwards of 100 million years and possibly longer. A spider was in the midst of attacking a wasp that had become entangled in its web, and it's the only such fossil found thus far to depict such an arachnid attack. It would have been the wasp's worst nightmare to see the spider approaching it, and since the tree resin covered and captured them both, that nightmare never ended. 12. Immortal Combat Two insects found in an exquisite piece of amber kind of served to epitomize the idea of ant warfare. A two species of ants were revealed to have been locked in combat for more than a hundred million years. Now, According to researchers, the minute critters were so focused on waging war upon one another that they just did not notice when tree resin was covering them, which of course fossilized over time. Since the critters' jaws were still locked together, it is possible that the two ants were fighting over a food source or maybe caught up in the midst of one trying to raid the nest of another. Researchers say that the specimen located in Myanmar might provide the clearest evidence yet regarding insects displaying advanced social behavior, although in this case, maybe it should be anti-social behavior. 11. A Bargain in Amber Whoever was selling a chunk of fossilized tree resin at a market in Myanmar obviously did not know the treasure it contained because after experts obtained it and examined it with CT scans, it was revealed that the amber contained the tail tip of a small, flightless, bipedal dinosaur, a creature that existed some 99 million years ago. The scans further revealed that the tail was feathered with a pale underside and a coloration of chestnut brown. Experts say the theropod's tail would have been flexible and long with those feathers running down its sides. And this rare find from 2016 is expected to help researchers better understand the evolution of feathers dating from dinosaurs to modern day birds. 10. Staying Power Now the really impressive part of this story is that this arachnid was preserved for such a long time in such a compromised position. A daddy long leg spider was discovered trapped in amber for nearly a hundred million years, and several theories abound as to why the critter was caught with his pants down, so to speak. Experts say it's possible the subject was already preparing himself for copulation just as it was trapped in amber. However, experts say no female was found near that fossil in Myanmar. At any rate, the animal was identified as related to modern-day harvestman spiders, and those critters are thought to have been crawling about the planet for some 400 million years. 9. Myanmar Mashup A truly bizarre discovery was made at one of the richest deposits of Cretaceous Amber in Myanmar, and it's considered to be an extinct wingless wasp found inside amber that dates about 100 million years old. The characteristics of several different insects are exhibited by this animal. The strong hind legs are reminiscent of a grasshopper, and they would have been useful for jumping or for pulling itself out of crevices into which it had burrowed. The insect also displays the thick abdomen of a cockroach and some ant-like antenna, and its face possesses a jagged stinger, not unlike a wasp, and likely used that stinger to attack rival insects. Because the animal is so unique, researchers created an entirely new family for it that does include wasps and bees. Eight, first salamander in amber. These amphibians are unlikely to be found in the Caribbean islands these days, but it was a different story some 20 to 30 million years ago. An extinct species of salamander was discovered in early Miocene amber in the mountains of the Dominican Republic. Experts noted that the animal is a close relative of salamanders found in the modern-day Appalachians. And it's also noted that the tree in which the amber was discovered is a closer relation to the trees of East Africa than those of the Caribbean. 
So this juvenile specimen might offer some clues as to how life on the islands evolved. Current theories posit that salamanders could have reached those islands by attaching themselves to floating logs and various types of vegetation. What do you think? Seven, ancient arthropods in amber. Gall mites get the name from the galls or growths and other damage left behind they leave on the plants upon which they feed. There are some 3,600 species of these plant parasites so far described in modern times. However, the earliest of the lot seem to have existed around 230 million years ago. That's the approximate age of the mites found encased in amber in Italy's Dolomite Alps. Experts say they not only represent the oldest arthropods found in amber, the wee beasties are the first amber-encased arthropods ever found from the Triassic. In all, three ancient specimens were found in 2012. The third animal was a midge fly, and it took a lot of patience to locate the critters, because in all, experts analyzed some 70,000 droplets of amber, none of which were over 6 millimeters long. Now, one of the mites measured about 210 microns long, and that would be about twice the diameter of a human hair. And at two millimeters large, that midge fly we mentioned, well that went about the size of a pinhead. Six, scorpion find. The Chiapas Highlands of Mexico is known to be rich in amber, and further evidence of that was supplied in 2015 when the amazing fossil specimen of a scorpion was unearthed. Now, what's really unique about this male specimen is that a farmer is said to have dug it out of the dirt by hand. Under 18 millimeters long, the arachnid was exceptionally well preserved in a large drop of fossilized tree resin. Dated at more than 20 million years old, this one is likely a new species. Now, to find a complete fossilized scorpion is exceedingly rare, although maybe not so much in Mexico. Did you know that more than 250 species of scorpions have been found there? Five, a classic collection. So maybe this is as close as we're gonna to get to a real live version of Jurassic Park. At least that's what some researchers involved with a discovery in the jungles of Myanmar were saying. A collection of 12 lizards was found there, perfectly preserved in amber. Estimated to be around 100 million years old, that would predate Triceratops and T-Rex. Included in the collection are fossilized chameleons and geckos, two specimens of which were proven to be related to the present-day reptiles. Complete fossils of lizards from the Cretaceous period are rare, so experts are hopeful that this discovery could help explain some ambiguities in the lizard family tree. Four, alien in amber. Now here is a critter found in amber that had such an alien appearance that experts could not fit it into any known order of insect. So they had to make one up, especially for this beast. The bizarre looking insect was discovered in the mines of Hukong Valley in Myanmar in 2017, and the fossil is dated at about 100 million years old. The animal would have had a triangular head with bugged out eyes and likely benefited from having 180 degree vision just by angling its noggin to the side. Now this female specimen was wingless and it might have used a chemical secretion as a type of defense mechanism. Now, so far, only one other specimen from this species has ever been found and that was also in Myanmar. Three. Armored arachnid attack. So we've told you about some ants and some ants and wasps that were locked up in mortal combat over an extended period of time. And how would you like to be frozen in time with your worst enemy? It kind of sums up the case of these two ancient arachnid antagonists that were locked up in fossilized tree resin for some 99 million years. The mortal combatants belonged to an unusual species whose bodies were covered with a type of armor thought to protect them from wasps and from other predators. The males had fangs and two pronged horns atop the heads. Experts say the specimens were purchased from a dealer in China, but were initially discovered in northern Myanmar. While this species is extinct, they do have some relatives that survive in modern times, and they are often referred to as armored spiders. Two, feathers in amber. 
In 2011, a major discovery was made in Alberta, Canada. Dated at around 80 million years old, 11 specimens were found there. More properly identified as proto-feathers, the primitive structures appear almost hair-like and probably belong to theropods that roamed Alberta when it was still a swampy forest region in the late Cretaceous. Experts say the preservation was so complete that microscopic details of the feathers, including their structure and pigmentation, remained intact, indicating shades of brown and black. As for what purpose those feathers served, well, it was most likely to keep the dinos insulated and not for any type of flight. One, scorpion plus spider equals scorpida. Around a million centuries ago, or a hundred million years if you prefer, an arachnid existed that could nearly pass as a spider and scorpion hybrid. Paleobiologists found the creature's remains preserved in Burmese amber in Myanmar. And that specimen had a body length of two and a half millimeters, while its tail measured about three millimeters. But this small critter presented some big questions for experts. Their whip-like tails are similar to those of the present-day whip scorpions, which are not true scorpions either. But these ancient mysterious arachnids did possess several traits typical of true spiders, including spinnerets to create silk. So these newly unearthed animals could be an example of a Lazarus taxon with no fossil record. Or they might have belonged to an extinct group that shared some similar origins with spiders. In any case, the arachnids could prove that spider-like creatures with tails existed alongside true spiders as far back as 200 million years ago.